Okay. Thrive. <laughs> Very nice little intro there. Gotta, gotta respect it. So, welcome to Thrive. So this is like... Uh, looking at their page, it's so early in development that I, I can't say... I have to say more of what it's going to become. Thrive is basically looking to become Spore 2. Now, they don't say that anywhere, but they want to have evolution through different stages of uh, life's development, starting with a cell stage. But they do want to add a lot more, like a multicellular stage and stuff, which seems really complicated, but we'll see how they do with that. But basically, um, the game is free, first off, and the link will be in the description. And currently what it is, is basically a cell survival simulator. So if you've ever wanted to be a cell, well, congratulations. You, you can do so in this game. There's a few different um, nutrients we have to acquire, basically, to be able to grow our cell. Uh, right now we're collecting some glucose so that we can go through mitosis. And each time you go through mitosis you get to evolve your cell. So you can't just choose when to do it. You actually have to to the point where I was eaten. I was eaten. Oh, that's unfortunate. So your population can actually go extinct. And all of the other cells are actually... Oh, I'm not big enough to eat these guys. All of the other cells are actually also evolving at the same time. The game is evolving the other cells through AI so it's kind of a battle who can evolve the fastest and if they evolve first they're going to get faster and more dangerous and they're going to have a uh, great time murdering you so there is a bit of challenge to it I have beaten it once just so that I knew what I was doing uh, if you are playing the keys to play G turns on eating other cells mode uh, E shoot stuff out uh, toxins, but you have to unlock that first by getting the correct part for the cell. But let us just get to the point where we can split. So we're getting phosphates right now. We need to get some ammonia. We need to find ammonia. So we're floating around being a cell. We've just got to find more ammonia. As you can see, when I was getting that ammonia, the cell was growing because we had all the resources required to create amino acids. Oh, there we go. Everything we have doubled, and now we can go into the editor and mitosis time. So you can see all the different parts we have available to us. Uh, we can go, you can actually, which I think is interesting, you can get uh, prokaryotic structures, which are basically things you would find in bacteria, but you could also use them. You can create a hybrid cell. So what we're going to do is Glucose is pretty easy to get, so I'm not worried about chloroplasts. Um, toxin vacuole. That's an important one, because otherwise hydrogen sulfide is actually... Uh, oh, no, that's the wrong one. Oh, well, that one's useful, too. Um, the toxin vacuole lets you create oxy uh, oxytoxy uh, NT. I don't know what the NT stands for, though. Um... Which you can shoot at other cells, and then you can hopefully destroy them in either wonderful organelles to grow yourself. But there we go. Now, now we have a, a new organelle. Look at that. Now we do have to keep in mind that to divide the next time, we're going to have to duplicate that as well. So it's going to get slightly more challenging to multiply. But here we go, getting some phosphides. Oh, geez. I was eaten again that was that was pretty rude not quite as cute as for but I do like the fact that they're trying to keep it uh, accurate Wow the screen is so blue it's actually making my face blue that's fantastic blue man spike I should go on avatar <laughs> so this is kind of a calm game right now I mean you can be eaten but the they if I so here's a few points of uh, suggestions for them. First off, if you're being eaten or something, the music should turn a little bit more intense. I think that would definitely do a lot for the mood and make it seem a bit more exciting. Um, definitely make the other cells a little bit more aggressive. 
I mean, for the most part, they just float around. But I guess that's realistic. I guess they're trying to... It's gotta be hard to balance realism with uh, gameplay in this case. Because as it stands, it's not that inaccurate and it's still pretty fun. I mean, there isn't much of a game here, but if they add more, I do see this being a pretty fantastic, uh... Okay, I'm being in again! Ah, darn it! Yikes, I'm really falling behind this time around. Last time I was, like, king of the hill, I was taking over everything. Oh, wow. I ate them, but they were full of toxins. Oh, we got- we, we went extinct. Oh. We were forgotten. <laughs> so we're getting all of the different things we need to build amino acids. This is very exciting stuff. Some phosphates. Come on. Come on. Yes! Okay, now we can go into the editor. So this time we're going to do this correctly. Um, sadly, I've never been able to get the predatory pilus or Celia, but that's okay. We're going to go with a mitochondrion, which is the powerhouse of the cell. I'm sure you guys know that. And then we're going to go into... Wow. Look at that. The mitochondria is the powerhouse of the cell. And now we're going to go and get a flagellum, just so that we can move a little bit faster. Here we go. Finish. And now we're a fast boy! Look at us go! We're... Oh, we, we kind of look like... A certain kind of cell um please don't age restrict this video YouTube don't do it it's cellular biology it's kid friendly why am I dying I am currently dying I am so dying right now oh my oh because I'm out of ATP I used up all my energy reserves how could I be so dumb we duplicated our flagella so we actually ran out and then I was instantly eaten. Our population is actually quite low, which is concerned. No! Ah, oh, not that bug. Now my entire body just disappeared. Great. That's another issue with dying. There's a chance for that bug to happen where everything goes yellow. Ah, uh, okay. We really, we have to do better. We have to take over the pond. We got to do it. Here we go. Another another cutscene. Okay. We can do this. I believe in us. Let's go. We've got it. Whoosh. Why am I so fast? Huh. Oh, there it goes. Just had to wait for the uh, slight amounts of lag to kick in. It does need a bit of optimization. I think part of the issue is because I'm playing 4K, but like there's no option to go full screen, so I can't do under 4K unless I was to like changed my entire recording settings in OBS, which I refuse to do, because that would be a mess. And you know what, I think it's kind of, uh, calm and just relaxing. I think it was faster, it would be pretty much impossible to dodge those, uh, toxin things, so. Here we go, we're gonna get some ammonia, we're gonna get some hydrogen sulfide, and we're gonna get some phosphates. Oh, we actually have enough phosphates. Oh, we can go into the editor. Fantastic. Okay. Chloroplast! Now we won't run out of glucose anytime soon. We'll actually get two. Can I rotate it? I was curious about this before. I do not think you can rotate. We're going to become a triangle, I guess. That works. Um, and we will give ourselves the ability to move slightly faster. Okay, never mind. I guess I'll just... Bam, now we're like a triangle without a single little piece of the triangle. We're the Illuminati! Look at us! We are the Illuminati. We've got the eye in the center and everything. Our nucleus is a beautiful eyeball. Very good. The cell, the, the first cell to invent the triangle. Look at us. So proud. But now we're gaining glucose just by like floating around because we do in fact have chloroplasts. Which is indeed very exciting. Okay, so we've got plenty of hydrogen sulfide. We've got plenty of pretty much everything except for phosphates. Although we slowly use up hydrogen sulfide, so it's smart to get extra. Okay, ammonia. 
We've got enough ammonia. The only thing we're lacking was phosphate. So you gotta balance it because you're always using your resources, but you need to have all of them at the same time in order to make the amino acids. Welcome to the life of a cell. <laughs> it's a very simple life, you know? You, you don't even know of your own existence. You're floating through space. You Basically, if you were an actual cell, you'd have to play this game except with your eyes closed. And then it's a pretty accurate representation of being a cell. You don't really know what's going on, but you're still surviving anyways for some reason. Oh, okay, it didn't crash. Great, that would have been really sad. I'm gonna eat you. I'm to- Oh! Oh, I'm succeeding! Oh, I eat that cell. Look at us! Wait, can we eat this cell too? No, he's a little bit too big. Okay. I'm gonna eat you guys. Look at me. I am now a big enough cell that I can eat other cells. I'm so proud. I'm so proud of this community. <laughs> oh boy. Look at us. We're looking pretty darn nice. Although we've used up like all of our hydrogen sulfide for energy. Oh, okay, so here's the plan. We get the hydrogen sulfide really quickly. And then we make a swoop around for the phosphates. There we go. This is strategy right here. Phosphates, here we come! Dodge the toxin! Whoosh! Yes! We grew! Great. Not enough, but we did grow a little bit. Okay, we need... We need some more phosphates. Come on. Come on, phosphates. Right here, right here, right here. There we go. Yes! Beautiful. Okay, we need even more phosphates. Oh man, we need a lot of phosphates. Let's just eat all the phosphates. Are we ready yet? Are we there yet? <laughs> Gotta keep asking the question. I want to evolve. Let me evolve. Oh. Oh, I thought it changed. I thought I could evolve. This is our longest survival run. I find it funny because last time I played through the entire thing and I didn't die once. I think I'm just in, like, a harder uh, environment. I think my, uh competition is just a bit better this time but this one's a lot calmer than the other one the other one that one kind of saw that was just firing out like five billion toxins there was no way to beat it it was deadly man it was scary there was no way to survive against it great now we can go back to the editor and now we can become speedy but we're gonna need a mitochondrion to power that. Okay, here we go. Look at us now! Very nice! So now we've got a little bit of speed behind us as well. And we're still gaining ATP, so we do have our uh, energy balanced. Very exciting. I'm dying. I'm no longer dying. Good! That, that's fantastic. I like not dying. Hey, Cell, how's it going? I'm doing pretty well as well. Oh, look! Our own species is bullying the other species. Wait, are we eating our own? Are you guys... Oh, no. Flashing just means they're in eating mode. Not that they're being eaten. Okay, I'm gonna eat this dude, though. Get over here! I am to absorb you. Fantastic. 10 out of 10. Ooh, hydrogen sulfide. Can I get there before everyone else does? Everyone else is eating it. That's rude. I need to get the supplies I need. Okay, fantastic. Good job, me. Let's just let's just run through here. Oh, oh, oh no, I'm gonna be eaten by that guy. That's a big cell. Okay, let's steal this guy's success. Because he just ate that cell, but now I'm eating him. It's like that diagram with the bigger fish eating the smaller fish all the way down. We eat the cell that eats the other cell. So proud of my cell. He's doing so well. Okay. Just need to collect a little bit more phosphates. We're almost ready, though. Look how quickly we're growing. Oh. 
Black Spike. Something new has evolved! I don't actually know what causes it, but something happened. Maybe garbage collection. Uh, that's usually what causes lag spikes in games. Um... Wait, are those toxins? I knew it too. I saw the toxins inside of it. No! Oh. Okay. Well, you know what? I think I gave it a good run. I think we uh, saw a lot that the game has to offer. There is a lot of different things in it right now. They're always adding to it. It's a work in progress. It's at 0 0.4. Um... But I think the important thing is it's free, it's open source, and you can download it at the link in the description. Tell me what you think. I think it has a lot of potential, and I think that the graphics look really nice, the gameplay isn't terrible. It's a little bit limited right now, but it isn't terrible, and um, it's so early in progress. I think this is better than some finished games, at least. Uh, you can really tell they're trying to put quality into it. So I will see you all next time, and go check it out, because it is free. Bye!